Oh, welcome back to Tashman Gaming. Very different video for you today. As stated before, we were going to look at bringing you VR videos. Well, guess what's just arrived? Jim, fuck off for me, please. You're still in my picture. Thank you. The VR is here. It arrived today. The Meta Oculus Quest 2. Um, so we're going to do a little unboxing for you, um, show you what's inside, a uh, little small review on the Oculus, um, nothing too OTT, we're not here for reviews really, we're here, we're a gaming channel obviously, but I'm going to give you a little tiny review on the Oculus, uh, I have had one before, um, I have taken the tape off already so I don't look an idiot, uh, I look an idiot enough on these videos without making myself look even more stupid, um, so yeah, we're going to unbox the Oculus, uh, we're going to bring you some VR game into the channel. Um, so yeah, and we're going to give you a little review on it. Uh, and then potentially later on do a few videos, do a few uploads, and then bring you a proper uh, review if you're looking to buy one. So these come in two different sizes, 128 and 256 gig. This one is the 256 gig one. Um, I got it because of obviously potentially the amount of gaming we're going to be doing. And if the game is popular, I want to keep the games to be able to go back and do part twos and threes, etc. Um, if you're looking to save a bit of money, go for the cheaper option. You can still get quite a few games on there stored. Uh, and the potential is if you're buying it for your son or daughter or brother or mother or, or partner, um, by the time they finish the game, you're going to delete it and then you can get a new game anyway. So I would personally save the £100 and go for the cheaper option. Okay, so let's get this unboxed and I'll show you what's inside. There we go. Comes in quite a nice presentation box. Uh, very bland, just the Oculus logo, which I think is pretty cool. There's nothing OTT here. Uh, and then we pop it open, and inside is the Oculus. Uh, it looks very simple, and that's because it pretty much is. Uh, Oculus have gone sort of out of their way, um, gone out of their way to not complicate things this is a headset that doesn't require a pc it doesn't require anything else everything you need is in this box which is fantastic there's a lot of vrs out there you have to plug into a pc you have to play it through a pc this is all here which makes this quite unique okay so these are your handheld controllers obviously okay i'm doing this backwards so let me just verify which one's which so this is your left. So let's swap these over. Okay. This is your left. This is your right. Okay. Yes, yeah, so you have your A and B buttons. You have your analog sticks and you have your triggers. Okay. Each one of these turns into your hand while you're playing the game, which is great. You've got your Oculus button, which takes you to your main menus and you've got your settings buttons. These are battery operated. Okay. And they last forever. You don't have to plug these in. You don't have to do anything. They come with your safety cables, so they can go around your arms exactly as a Nintendo Switch or a Nintendo Wii. Saves you flinging them across rooms and so on and so forth. This is your Oculus headset. Now this is where the magic happens. Okay, let's get rid of this a bit quick. As you can see, you have motion sensors and cameras built in to the headset. Okay, what makes this a fantastic piece of kit, which when I first played and used this, to, to which I was quite new to the VR world. You can see through this using the cameras. So when you first put it on, it's just like looking as you are now. You get everything set up depending on what room you're using or what, sorry, what room you're in. You set up a, a boundary. Um, so that boundary gives you limitations so you walk your room um, and you mark out a boundary and then it stops you putting these through windows tvs etc etc unfortunately it doesn't stop you whacking people around the head so make sure people are well clear when you're playing but this gives you a boundary line now when you step out of that boundary the cameras kick in straight away and you can see straight back through so you can see where you are where you've gone wrong and you can reset yourself 
So it's quite a great safety feature on the Oculus, properly well thought out. Uh, your hard drive and everything is built into this headset. Headphones, hard drive, everything is on here. And you see that through putting it on and it comes up as a display inside on your lenses. Okay, this Oculus has no cables, as I explained before. This is everything. You put this on your head, you turn it on, and off you go. You play. It's a nice, sleek design. Bit of a pain that it's white. Um, does dirty up, obviously. Um, but it's a nice, sleek design. Volume button underneath, so when you're using uh, the headphones that are built in, you can do your volumes up and down, etc., etc. So, yeah, uh, tightening strap for people with massive heads and tiny heads. You can change these straps, these are detachable and you can get a ratchet strap, which is really easy to get, uh, which I'm just about to order. Um, so it keeps it nice and crisp, you just pop it on, turn the ratchet, it's done to your head size. Um, but this one, obviously fully adjustable. It's only gonna be adjusted to my head because I won't let anybody use it anyway. Just kidding. So yeah, so that's the headset. Um, like I say, uh, no cables, no nothing, hard drive built in games you just download straight to the headset you can also download um, certain apps on here and you can watch uh, TV and 3d uh, sorry 4d videos um, all in uh, HD which is fantastic you can actually download uh, virtual YouTube videos down onto here as well uh, just one for example you can be in a racing car and you're sat as a passenger while someone's driving um, and gives you the whole obviously VR experience I know there's an app where you can download roller coasters um, I've had that app, it actually makes me feel sick. Um, however, if that app does make you feel sick, there's a zone out dot on the screen. You stare at the dot and believe it or not, within five seconds, you feel normal again. Um, so everything has been thought of. The games on here are, are phenomenal. There's, there's one where you can go and visit the Titanic, you're underwater. There's obviously your fighting games and so on and so forth. Uh, look into it, look into the games a bit more. Uh, I think one of the biggest, highest selling games, and I may be wrong, is uh, Beat Saber, is it? Um, supposed to be a phenomenal game. Uh, I haven't played it myself, but I, I believe in the VR world it's number one, or it was last time I checked anyway. Um, so yeah, so that's the headset. It's very comfortable as well on the face. You don't really feel claustrophobic, etc., etc. It, it, it really does feel just like you, just like wearing a baseball cap, if you like. And then this, uh, I'm not lying to you. This is the only cable required for the Oculus. Okay, and that is bum 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 charger. It's your typical C adapter. It plugs directly into the headset. Uh, you charge it up. Takes. Uh, I'm not going to lie to you, I'm not going to tell you how long it takes, I don't know, but I do know that you get, obviously, three to four hours gameplay. Um, doesn't seem like a lot, but trust me, when you're playing VR, three to four hours is way more than enough. Um, so yeah, so that's the only cable you get with the Oculus. Uh, it's literally just a, a charge it up, pop it on your head, turn it on, point at the game that you want to play, and off you go. One thing I can recommend for friends and family and so on and so forth, obviously you've got the walk the plank now, if you don't know what that is, go on to YouTube, have a look. Um, I have done this with so many people, and the best result is to get a plank of wood, a scaffold board, whatever, uh, and make people walk the plank. Um, and you, you will see a complete new side to VR, trust me. Uh, people sometimes don't realise just how good these kits are. Um, you know, you can get the ones where you slide a mobile phone into the device, and yeah, okay, it gives you the VR effect, etc., this really does make you feel like you're in a completely different world. It is an absolute game changer. Uh, if you haven't tried an Oculus, go into Curry's PC world, go into um, Smith's, go wherever, see if they've got one on that you can try. If not, look at the reviews. You will not be disappointed. Um, keep an eye out on my channel. You'll see the games coming up. You'll see just exactly what they're like. But they're you, honestly, experiencing it yourself on your head is the only way to really get the best experience out of this. Okay, so stay tuned to the channel. We will be bringing you some VR games coming soon. So there you have it. I hope you liked the video. Like I say, a bit of a different video. Um, but I just thought I want to try and keep people traveling with the channel. I don't want to just do things and, and leave people behind. I want to explain our 
it's like a baby being born. I want to watch you, you watch us grow and we grow together and hopefully the videos become better, the editing becomes better, the sound becomes better. Um, my aim is to try and produce the best channels. Even if people don't subscribe, I enjoy doing it. Um, so please give the channel some love. Please subscribe, please like, and we will see you in the next video. Peace.